In this video, we will be taking a simple discount rate and converting it into simple interest, and taking simple interest and converting it into a simple discount rate. So as we looked in the previous lessons, we looked at a lot of different terms and how they relate and how they're different between simple interest and simple discount. So in this lesson, what we're doing is we're calculating how to take a simple discount rate and convert it to simple interest and then the other way around. So there's only one example for this lesson. So let's look at the example one, letter A. We're taking a simple discount rate and we're going to convert that to simple interest. So here's our formula. We're going to go the discount a 10% and then we're going to go 1 minus discount times time. And the discount again is 10% which we're going to convert to a decimal and then also what we have here is for the time we have 180 days over 360. So once we calculate this out we would find out that our answer would end up being 10.53 percent if we rounded it. Or what we could write on there would be the exact number would end up being 105263. So if we convert that into a percent, it'd be 10.5263, or we could just say 10.53%. So in this example here, we're converting from a simple discount to a simple interest. Let's look at part B. So part B, we're taking a simple interest and converting it to a simple discount. So we know our rate, simple interest rate is 11%, and we know that our rate is still 11% for this formula, and then our time is 140 days over 360. Now we're going to convert this to a decimal as well. So once we calculate this out, we would end up finding that the answer would be 1055 or convert that decimal to percent 10.55 percent. So this lesson was demonstrating how to take a simple discount rate and convert it into a simple interest rate and how to take a simple interest rate and convert it into a simple discount.